Alright, so... Guys, I fucking love the title screen to this game. I've kind of just been watching it for the past five minutes, and I'm totally okay with that. It's just really good. Great song, great aesthetic. Love the lightning coming off of the logo. Anyway, that's not important. I took a couple weeks off of this stream series that I had literally just started. Like, I did one stream of Revengeance, and then the next week, it was the Game Awards, so I didn't stream. The week after that, there was a windstorm, and my internet went down. Couldn't stream then. Today, there is also a windstorm. My internet has not gone out yet. Could happen at any moment. Who knows? But, until that happens, let's play some Revengeance. I forget what file I was using. Probably this one. I played for roughly two hours. Let me see. Let me go to the chapter select. Uh, no. This one has up to... N no, that's not the file I want. <laughs> that is a different file. I guess the the timer only ticks uh, during actual gameplay, because I definitely streamed for like at least two hours. Let me check. Apologies, I should have checked this ahead of time. Uh, what is going on? Must have been this file. Let me check the VR missions. So we did some VR missions last time I streamed. It says this one is new. Hey guys, where did my file go? <laughs> well, okay, this is interesting. Uh. It seems I've uh, lost the file that I was using. So, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna... Nope, that's the wrong file. This is not... I mean, this is the right file. This is the file I'm going to have to use. I'm gonna use chapter select and go back to, to where we were. Very interesting. <laughs> Okay. Uh Okay. Okay. So, we were here. And nope. I want our Oh my god. Does this game not have an autosave? <laughs> what happened to my file, folks? Alright, here's what we're gonna do. <laughs> here's what we're gonna do. Oh my god. I'm pretty fucking sure this game is supposed to autosave. Vengeance, properties, hold on a sec. Local files, no. General. Is there a way to check when the last file was in the Steam Cloud? Steam Cloud is enabled. No, oh, whatever. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Is I'm gonna have to select my main file that has a ton of shit unlocked. <laughs> this is so stupid. Not fucking playing the game on normal. So, all that said and done, let's pick up where we left off. Let's see what outfit I was using on my main file last time I played. We already watched this cutscene last time. Kind of want to watch it again because it's funny. <laughs> so you've got 
got some kind of disguise lined up, right? I just want to see his dumb disguise and I'll skip it. Hope so. You'd be a little conspicuous just walking the streets. Relax, Kev. I'll blend right in. You sure will. All right. It's right. I'm in the sewer system. All right. Let's get started. Ooh. Your mission's to oh, invest wow. in Desperado-affiliated research center somewhere in that area. This file is definitely a file I've not used in a long time because the controls are inverted. FYI, they're also involved with the cartels in human trafficking. Allegedly, anyway. <laughs> this just gets better and better. Tell me about it. We need you to infiltrate the lab and find out everything you can. Of course, you'll have to find it first. We still don't know the exact location. So I'm looking for anywhere the lab might hook up with the sewers? Yep. If they're actually dumping waste, they've got to link up somehow. Find that connection, sneak into the lab, and see if you can find evidence implicating them on anything. No problem. Stealth's my specialty. Right. Well, we'll see. Do we have any idea what kind of research they're doing there? Not really. Maybe something related to all the people they're trafficking. Like experimentation? It's possible. First things first, though. Find a way into that lab. Oh, right. It says here, the locals say black crocodiles live in those sewers. So, you know, uh, watch out. <laughs> black crocodiles? Could they be talking about UGs? Maybe just an urban legend. But still, be careful. I will scout ahead. Is it... <sighs> <will> provide backup. <laughs> Already got... Sir, yes, sir. Ripper Come. mode unlocked. <laughs> this is... This is gonna... I'm just gonna Operation. use only what I could have possibly... Oh, God. And I've got Sam's sword equipped. Oh, Lord. All right. Uh, hold on. <laughs> so. Okay. Uh, options. I need to uninvert my controls. I can't do that anymore. Sorry, old me. I've become a shell of my former self. Right. Unidentified two Gs are patrolling the sewers. Exercise caution. Alright, so. Last time we played, we beat Mistral. When you beat bosses in this game, you can buy their weapon. So, let's... We got it. We got Mistral's weapon. Which is actually pretty good in my memory. And it's kind of the weapon I use the most of the boss weapons. I'm not crazy about uh, the next boss weapon we get, but that's a bridge we'll cross uh, when we get there. Now, I remember these boys being stun masters. I have to wiggle my ass off if I ever get hit by them. Better take out that UG quick. I do have the suit though now, because I'm using my old file, so that's cool. I like the suit. I'll see what else I have unlocked in this file. Uh, Next time we're between chapters. I see a maintenance catwalk. Use it to conceal yourself if necessary. <sighs> yeah, it's a bit of a trade off using the boss weapons. Oops. Nope, that's my bad. I overestimated uh, how generous Sprint is for being stealthy. One thing about this game is it's very easy to get turned around. This is back the way I came, but I'm curious what's in here. This is the way I'm supposed to go. Uh, the downside to uh, 
Oh wait, this is the way I came. Okay. It's the way I'm... Yeah, okay. Gotcha. Um... The downside to using my old file is... I've already unlocked almost everything. So, I mean, that's, I guess that's a good thing that I don't need to worry about uh, picking things up. Right. There is a boy in these sewers. But still, it's fun to see if I remember uh, where unlockables are, and now I uh, got to do that. That's what happened when you lose your save data. I don't know what caused that. I'll have, to, I'll have to rewind the tape and see if it just like never saved or something. Let's go see the weird boy. I don't normally do secret mission stuff because I don't like it, how it's handled in this and Bayonetta, but uh, this boy I'll make an exception for. Oh no, he got me. I guess it's not really a secret mission, but you know, yeah, now how it is. Let's go save George character I thought I would hate when he first showed up, but it turns out I like him. I don't know, you see that kid for the first time and you're like, oh great. A ch an annoying child character, but uh, he turns out to be pretty cool. Oh, is this how you're gonna do me dirty? A random hit button. I have some kind of like damage upgrade <laughs> on this file because uh, I seem to be cutting through everything pretty fucking fast. What up, Ed? How's it going? You really think sleep is more important than seeing your friend Raiden uh, yeah. cut through I'm tons of robots? Call me Raiden. My name George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America, President. President. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Me? What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no, I'm looking for bad guys. Damn Scunter is search lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, you know one of them scunt, nah? Nah, I guess you're all right. If you're a cyborg... I think it's really interesting you know how they subtitled this guy. Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, maybe live on the street. Catch around, Dad. Thanks for dropping in. Then this good need dressed like the mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What the worst gonna happen now? What the mother like they very well could have gotten away with not having like two separate subtitles on this guy, but I dig it. All kids like you? Yeah, 
a lot of why. But then me been over here, what them skunk want to do? Snuff us out. And got all day all game. So you ran? Uh-huh. Is she me not a bad ass robot ninja man? Same as you! Ha! <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. Starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just plain, nah? Me done plenty bad thing. But me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say, I would his brain would get cut out. Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. George, I need every detail about how you escaped. <laughs> You're right and take it down a notch. Oh my god. So the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah, he says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a sentry cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find the server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need. I also really like how this game handles Kodak, not necessarily in the sense of, like, walk and talk, so because the walk and talk is kind of annoying. Sure the area was secure and told them to sit tight. But I like that other sure. characters can butt in, more. and it still just shows just the portrait of both characters. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Like, if you Agreed. compare it to, like, an right old now. Metal Gear, it's only ever you and the person you're talking to, and the, the portrait of the other person constantly switches back and forth, but I like how they just slide in a new portrait. Oh, I gotta do something real dumb here. Some way you can sneak past? Uh, what is the combo I'm looking for? Here we go. Yeah, gotta cut up these these generators. Gotta make as many parts as possible. I don't remember if Chip does this in his LP. I don't know if like that's where I picked this up from. It's just a dumb thing I like to do. I think. Now it's 50,000. And then we'll call it. Yeah, there we go. We're good. 2040. It's... It's a box. How's that gonna help? Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work, actually. <laughs> I'm glad to see chat also agrees that they do exactly that thing. Oh, the camera in this game is not incredible, but... Eh, I'll fight. I'm here. Whoa, camera. Oh my god, camera, please calm down. I will not be fine, actually. I'm gonna about to die. <laughs> Here we go. This is what I was looking for. Or not. Not a very clean fight, but uh, <laughs> I got my stealth kills out of order. 
in the sense that I got none at all. We intercepted call for backup during no. your last fight. The caller's position is on your soliton radar. I'm not you can engage if bothering with secret it is your choice. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Right. I have determined the approximate location of the lab based on the boys' information. All right, now the enemy in this room is, in my opinion, the least fun enemy to fight. Because it just spits fire on you and then runs away. Story, so it's no big deal. I think I'd fight one more. Nope. Oh, no idea. Here we go. This is the wall I was looking for. So, a fake wall projection. Pretty well hidden, I gotta say. Are you guys ready to take a doom? appear to be the UG maintenance area. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UGs. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. But first you need to take a dump. I... Wait, what? <laughs> a dump? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlet eh, to control I'm not the really proxy. torn up that those All flamethrower right. guys Let's only show up shot. in one spot. I don't think they're very fun to fight. Now, granted, I'm probably just missing something about them. That I've, just, I've never been good at fighting them. Yeah, that is a fantastic camera angle. What's really cool about this game sometimes is you go to parry an attack and the camera angle changes on you. guy's got no spine. Guidance. If they continue to increase security, they may shut out all outside network connections. Now they'll be Please fine. Do your best to avoid being seen. I think you can trip every alarm and still be fine. It's kind of 
fucked up this brain room. <laughs> I didn't feel like aiming. <laughs> no, I was having fun. Excuse me, sir. I was doing things. Those were cyborg brain casings. Duh. We saw. George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes. This must be why they are trafficking children. Oh, this chapter has a lot of walk and talk. But they are definitely taking the brains. Jesus. Are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait. The cyborgs you've been fighting, did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So what? It's an interesting little way to hand wave that away. Like, oh no, no, don't worry, you aren't killing kids. Don't worry about it. The other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. Fun little segment. <laughs> Splendid! It is all ours. Now, use it to locate the data input terminal. These guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. Try latching onto cyborgs' heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. Hello. Woo! <laughs> oh no, I got spotted. Run! <laughs> go, little man, go! Never find me in here. Oh, camera, please. Enemy oh no. Go, go, go. <laughs> Time for one of the best little animations the in this game. Most likely designed to download mission data and such into the UGs. Let's try using it to access the lab server. Here we go. I like. I just like it. It's fun. You gotta flip the USB. It just makes sense. I found something in one of the Sentry Cyborg's visual logs. Guess who shows up? Patch it through. Right away. And send us what you do have. You've already commenced the art plan. The Sears program? Yep. Sending one old Georgie boy used Man, to I love to Sundowner. <laughs> I think and your work is light. 
His boss fight is the least exciting, and his song is the most... That's the most okay, but Sundown or the character himself. I fucking love it. It's not like we can just pop them out with an ice cream scoop. All right. Make your point. Oh, thank you for understanding. Say what you have now. I will destroy any unharvested inventory. Yeah? Yeah, they really should have flipped the USB twice. Children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here for them and the cities they burden. But just gathering the donors required a significant investment. Yes, yes, we'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we'll be dispose of our inventory in the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. Takumse is a demanding mistress. And America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? In Monty's killer. Yeah, Sundowner Just really does ham range. it up. Goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. Oh my the god, kids. I forgot that Think fucking nickname. Late. Only one way Christ. to find out. George was still alive. Maybe Californian wildfire. Mm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. You definitely seem familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. What? What's this about Crispin Freeman? Oh, wait. Crispin Freeman is son. Hold on. I need to pause and. I need to verify this. Hold on. <laughs> Vengeance, IMDb. <laughs> no, not the movie Revengeance. Give me the video game Revengeance. It, oh my god, that's incredible. Sundowner is Crispin Freeman. No, I couldn't tell, but now that like you pointed out... It's... It's Winston. It's Overwatch Winston. Oh my god, I love it. So much. Alright. I'm excited again. I love video games. This game fucking rules. Fuck that guy. <laughs> nope. God damn it. Ugh. Uh, I need to be going this way. I'm just gonna be listening for Crispin now when Sundowner next shows up. I think the next cutscene we really get Sundowner in is like, oh my That's god, this right. chapter has so much walk and talk. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off. No. I think the next cutscene we get uh, Sundowner in is like entry with all my movement data from that point on. right before you fight him. You think they got That's a really first. good cutscene. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Yep, that's not the action button. Yeah, man, Crispin's an old, old guy, old grandpa. <laughs> He's old, forty-six. This bastard is blocking the way. Push that thing back. I 
do I need to parry that? No, we're good. Oh! I was not paying attention. Man, I don't like... Uh, wiggle mechanic. This is like the one thing I actually wish straight up. I think I mentioned it last time I streamed, you know, four years ago. Uh, I really don't like wiggle mechanics. No, I'll come back. <laughs> ah, I parried that. Come on. Like that. There we go. I had a friend point out once that uh, this fight would have been a really good place to um, not use rules of nature, but use like that... Proto Rules of Nature song. I forget what it's called. It's a song that sounds like Rules of Nature but has different lyrics. It's gonna bother me that I don't remember what it's called. Right. I knew I'd seen that guy before. Stephen Armstrong. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. They're already talking about him as a shoe in for the nomination. Uh, I am playing on hard. And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury Is it funnier to switch Winston's to lines with Sundowners or the other way around? I don't know. The biggest PMCs out there. I think it'd be I pretty remember. funny to have Sundowner walk in and just go. Ever since the big five spread, Sorry for uh dropping in. The largest investor in military cyborg R and D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshall and Desperado in bed together. <laughs> Should make for some fun headlines. Headlines. This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking Cyborg about. Cyborg child brain that stays in motion. Even without the Wait, Patriots that filter, stays no in motion. Media outlet will investigate Payload that stays in motion like remains in motion. I forgot the line is. I was halfway through that line and then I realized, wait, so we just what? how does it go? Sit back while they keep carving up kids. Stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs. You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Cap. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit him first and hit him hard where it counts. I think this is the weakest chapter. <laughs> I forgot how much walk and talk there was in this chapter. In America, and America oh, has these things called laws. Mm -hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to Marshall. Yes, so what? <laughs> there are still laws. Okay, I'm liking all of these. You'd be heading right into the when the sundowner lines store. coming from Winston in chat. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus oh man, Winston would be a Kevin. fucking asshole. There we go. Jesus. This way. I wasn't even at the right door. Are oh, there some assholes with rocket launchers here? Yup, there it is. <laughs> Oh my god! An artificial blood cryo preserver. Fuck they me! They have begun preparatory freezing. What do you mean? That device is filled with synthetic blood plasma. It can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ, circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels. You can preserve an arm, a brain, any body part for several hours. So what are they freezing, and why? I could not say. Perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of. Unbelievable. You had best hurry, right? Right. There we Okay, now we're at the end. We're done this chapter. No more... I mean, there's still gonna be some walk and talk, but not to that egregious degree, I don't think. <laughs> what? Shit! The cutscenes in this game are animated so well. They stop right there. J 
George. Right in. You've heard of chloroform? A potent anesthetic in smaller doses. I'm sorry, Dirkus, you missed the uh, Go Ninja, Go Ninja, Go. That's literally like his second line in the video game. Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out. Surrender. Or decide. The needs of the many, or the needs of the few. Right in. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo. <laughs> Surrender. I won't ask again. George, are you sure? Hmm? Hmm. I'm ready. Me life now is so precious. Ting, what if me can take this scunt to hell with me? Cállate. Oh, Ryan's such an asshole. Stop it! Now! I'll kill him, I swear! Like that secret missions just like count so hard against your rank your rank. Oh lord. I got nothing but S and A, but because I didn't do the one secret mission, it's like ah B. Yeah, let's play with what customization I got. Let's see what outfits they have. Let's see. Well, gotta be mariachi. <laughs> we invade Detroit. <laughs> or Denver, I forget what city it is. Gray Fox is good. It's no mariachi. Yeah. I think people would get mad at me if I didn't pick mariachi. Yeah, okay, yes, I do have... <laughs> I did... <laughs> I did buy several strength upgrades. Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> yep. I was right. Oh my god, yeah. Loading into this file and just like immediately decimating an entire army going, Huh, I feel stronger than I used to be. This doesn't feel right. I didn't really touch these other weapons, which we'll get into later. I use some of this, I guess. I'm not a fan of the Psy, but I'm not going to use it because I haven't unlocked it yet, folks. I've already bought. Hold on. I'm missing one life upgrade. Apparently. Not here, but I mean, like, I only have 190% health. I think there's one in the game I just never got, but I couldn't tell you which one it is. is on his way to the Middle East this morning for his scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farouk Salam. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the region. Yo, me ninja brother! George. Ah, don't worry, the kid's okay, folks. How you feel? He's only literally cut in half. 
call them hunger spaces, and me never ever feel so awake, nah? That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh! Me been here you go while I got them scone in the base. Why the rat are you not take me with you, huh? Damn it, Doc. Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought she didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but... Killing isn't <laughs> fun in games. Yeah, Cobalt. Remember that. <laughs> right. Driving around in this normal ass car, and then you look inside and there's just riding a fucking walking death machine. <laughs> With the prettiest it's hair you've ever here. seen. immediately on site and then you'll pull over oh fuck me that's so good this game Private, rules what is this Kenya? you cannot resign sorry boris it's done can't have a maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now can we you could at least come talk to me no it was time to break away from the old team boris past time God, this game you is so good by yourself I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their parts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, right? They import those brains legally. For medical purposes, it's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Right, I... Hold that thought. I want to admire the restraint from... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's also American. I want to admire the restraint from Platinum for once in their lives not turning this into a segment you had to control. No Bayonetta Space Harrier segment. No, like, Wonderful 101, like all the billion different mini games you have to do in that game. The cool driving is just a cutscene, and you get to watch it, and it's cool, and it's not some half assed gameplay mechanic. Stick that leggy out. I will patrol ahead. Oh, did Platinum announce a new game? No, I haven't heard about it yet. What's up? Violation of state and federal law. Guess you'd better arrest me then. <laughs> Eighteen three one zero oh four point seven. Threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. JRPG. Uh, no, I'll have to look into this uh, afterwards. I have a very mixed relationship with Platinum. I think they're capable of very good things, but <laughs> hold on. I immediately got so distracted by the mariachi fit outfit that I immediately forgot uh, we had equipped. Um, I'm. I'm gonna not use sub weapons for a little bit. So I kinda like just the sword. Oh, it's the Grand Blue Fantasy. Yeah, okay, I remember hearing about that. That one up. I need to get oh hammer in this game sometimes. Oh right, he attacks multiple times. All right. Oh 
<laughs> okay, this is getting a little ridiculous. Hold on. Who's shooting me? You, sir. Could you fucking not? Oh, come on! Get back here! Ah, oh, you clown! I <laughs> cut off every limb from your body, but I missed the torso entirely. For real. Like your spine, please. Thank you. Anyway, um, I'm trying to remember, like. My launcher move? I forgot what the button combo is. Bombastic, I'm not part of Desperado. Desperado was the bad guys. The road is blocked by barricades. My dog shaped robot buddy. You will follow me. Cool. Oh, right. That move comes out multiple times. Yeah, they are kind of just on Healy's sliding around all the time. Hell yeah, look at that S rank. That's 1,000 everything. HQ, requesting the zone be designated for heightened security. I don't know why I'm coming towards this rocket launcher, because I'm, like, not going to use it ever. Oh. oh, I thought I could get him before it was too late. Oh, well. Thank you. Uh, yeah, Bombastic. I was using the, um, the L'Etranger for a bit. I used it for, like, all of Chapter 3. I just kind of wanted to use the sword for a while. I think I just like it more. I'm not like super crazy about the boss weapons in this game. They're okay. Not really my style. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. Do you really have to do this? Look, I'm fed up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Right it. Boris, listen to me. That VR training. They'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. 
We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. The big scissors are good. I definitely course. will show off to. all the weapons as I, I those kids from unlock cyborgs, them. But I can stop them from becoming murderers. So you succeed. So you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know a great cybernetic surgeon. You know an ungreat surgeon? That means he's bad. And your wife and son? What of them? They're in New Zealand. I never think Same. about them. They're not Who's important. Why I have to do I've this. only seen my son in the credits <sighs> of Metal right, Gear yeah, Solid yeah. 4. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Denver. Yeah, we've met I gotta write the second well, time. Then. I keep calling the city <clears throat> Detroit. Officially, Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. Now. Increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially, <laughs> I'll do all I can over the I just know the fucking help. worst doctor. Like he sucks ass. He's terrible. Spasiba, Tavarich. Spasiba. Oh no, it's a cow. Oh no, it's a multiple cows. Oh. You know what? That's another bad thing about this game, which I get because of technical limitations, but you can't just switch weapons on the fly. Yeah, I know they like they wanted to be able to switch weapons on the fly, it's just either due to the engine of this game, it, they just couldn't make it happen, which is unfortunate. have rockets the rocket guy immediately man I'm getting lucky with arms <laughs> I'm not even trying Oh, come on. Oh, come on. There we go. <laughs> the mariachi outfit is so dumb. It's, I love it. What a good video game. I am reviewing the pre flight Hey, Doc, now. are you still just the shittiest surgeon? To handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Hold yeah, on, I Twitch does. tags this game as VR? Let me see. Yeah, it does. Awesome. <laughs> that sounds stupid. It tags it as a stealth game. Yeah, okay. Uh huh. I'm stealthy. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data. The research. 
Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. I want to play a VR game that makes me feel like I'm gonna hurl. I need to experience that at some point. All I've played in VR is like Job Simulator and Super Hot, which are both totally cool and fine games. But I need to I need to experience the worst of VR. Uh, okay. That boy did not get popped up like I expected him to. Because he blocked it. Oh, oh. I am flying all over the place inadvertently. <laughs> Oh, that was such a bad idea. Why did I do that? <laughs> oh, Lord. No, Durkus, that's... Yep, that's... <laughs> you quote me on that. Oh my god, Raiden, you fucking jokester. You're supposed to be stronger than this. There we go. All right, let's not clown this up again. Ah, oh, what was that? I accidentally hit blade mode. Come on. I had so many good parries. No, 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 no. Don't throw a rock at me. Again with the arms. <laughs> I'm like literally not even trying to get these arms, and I've gotten like three of them this stream. Oh, I keep forgetting to attack multiple times. Alright, come on, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes with a random slice, you get it in one go. Sometimes it takes a couple dozen. Yes, I did intentionally blade cancel. <laughs> Arms more like ass. Oh, that was not a good video game. <laughs> In this gamer's humble opinion, ARMS was not very good. Oh. oh, multiple attacks, all right. Oh no, there's a second one! I don't deserve this. Oh. I would like your arms gone, please. <laughs> oh, and he attacks with his fucking incredibly large head. Oh. 
there we go. Show that guy who's boss. <laughs> when there's only one of them, not a huge deal. <laughs> when there's two of them, oh my god. Come on, get in the playing field, you sucker. Yeah, this game does have an upgrade system. I know there's a survivor up ahead, but I'm so bad at rescuing them, I'm not even going to try. I got two. I was wondering when the second prompt was going to show up. I do really like the Sphere Grid in Final Fantasy X, but I like it in Final Fantasy X. I don't know if, like, the Sphere Grid in Smash Brothers? Whatever. It's not like it really adds much. It's very minor upgrades for the most part. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. Never played Palm this city it, though. was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. There we go. Boop. Gotta turn this on every time I take any action, though. They still have not noticed you. Do not expose yourself. Gotta hide from the gorillas. Well, I think someone heard this. Yes. Okay. 
We're in it now, folks. Nope. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Everything in this game hits like a dump truck when they connect. Damn it. Oh, God damn it. Please put that arm away before you grab me. <laughs> That was a tracking drop kick. That's so rude. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord, Lord, Lord. All right, sorry. I can look at chat again. Is this my favorite platinum game? Yes, by far. If we're only counting exclusively Platinum and not, like, the lineage. Well, no, even then, I think this is probably... Uh, God damn it. There is a maintenance shaft up ahead. Use it to return to the like, surface. Thinking of what else? Uh, Platinum is explicitly worked on. Uh, Bayonetta, I like quite a bit. Bayonetta 2, I, th I think I prefer Bayonetta 1 just a little bit more. For oh my god. <laughs> Hold on, let's uh, get. Nope. You out. I haven't been getting grabbed by these guys a lot. <laughs> that arm away. Sorry, gorillas are like an intense fight, and I just like have to focus on them because they will mess you up. Um, do I count Near Automata as a platinum game? Yes, I do, and it's. I've talked about Near Automata in the past. I don't like it as much as I wish I did. Um, Wonderful 101 is a game I. Hmm. I love the gameplay in that game, but like, right. it would appear your only way I love the aesthetic of Wonderful 101. You will exit into an oh. I wish I loved the story of Wonderful 101. Collateral damage when engaging the enemy. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. I wish I loved the characters of Wonderful 101. I wish I loved little mini games of Wonderful 101. But all those sure add up. World Marshal headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. I never played Transformer tourist. Devastation. Sure. I'll just buy a quick I did play Vanquish. I think that game starts very right. strong, but then kind of just Remind me to teach you falls off sometime. after like halfway through. Your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Yep.
I also did not think <laughs> Revengeance was gonna be good. <laughs> After the, all the demos were just slicing watermelons. <laughs> with a character I don't particularly like. Okay, this guy's driving me up a wall. Get down here, you fool. game <laughs> is making me go aww and ooh a lot. <laughs> Every time I get hit by an attack, I'm just like, Bleh. oof. Even though I've beaten this game multiple times, and I'm like, I know. Compared to Devil May Cry, I, I like to think I'm at least halfway competent at this game and know what I'm doing. Even then, I still get pretty into this game. And getting hit by meaty attacks, just... Whoa! Here we go, there we go. Put away that RPG, sir. Yeah, this works. But no, he just kicked me in the fucking face. Oh no, there's a hammer, bro. Oh, this is so bad. Ugh. Let's thin the herd a little bit. Here we go. It's the VR getting to me. It's like I'm getting shot in real life. That away. No more hammer for you, but now you're gonna attack with your powerful, powerful skull. There we go. Head for the next objective marker. Now for the dumb part of this video game. <laughs> but then the best part of this video game. Oh no wait. Like one more fight. Enemy sighted! <laughs> Enemy sighted! It's that scene from Monty Python. <laughs> it's a guy running across a huge open field. The slide attack is so overpowered. Oh, there's a guy behind me. No, sir. You will get sliced in half, and you will enjoy it. Now, where's that dog-shaped robot, buddy? Here he is. Man, I'm having some timing issues on my button presses. Here we go. <laughs> what was that slide? <laughs> I slid all the way down the stairs. No second one? Oh, okay. No damage. Nice. Isn't 
jet stream, Sam. <laughs> and a little kid. Don't sell my accomplishments short. Sorry, I'm just gonna... Jetstream Sam will talk for a while if I let him. I do love Jetstream Sam, but I had enough walk and talk in Chapter 3. I just want to get this going. I want to get to the... My sword is a means to an end. Second best boss fight. You'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? I don't know, man. If I hacked, if I managed to hack all the ad reels in an entire city, I think I'd like to show it off. Sure, there are adults. Sure, they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually, they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, they sign up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear-inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender? Your blender? But they made their choice. Yes, I am a walking blunder. Open Thanks for the compliment. And see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nano suppress. Oh yeah, I've played all the DLC for this listen game. To them. What are you talking about? I think I only beat them once though. I might revisit them if I have time. <laughs> Can we take them? What's wrong? The way he killed all the others? Oh god. Please god, don't let me die. Let's do this! I am the This isn't fair. Little punk. Listen closely now. Die! This, this life! I watched my wife and son die. This is all I have left. You ain't shit! I need a job. Stop! I didn't know what I was signing up for. Pretty powerful stun batons. What a weenie. Finish him off. Whatever it takes to for you this torture. Stop it. Also, we can read minds now, I guess. What am I even fighting for? Bye, bitch. <laughs> There's a rocket, man. I really need to take care of that guy over there. Get over here. Only five days from retirement. I styled on those guys. Wow. Oh, man. I crushed it. I crushed the feeling zone. Raiden, are you injured? I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. Honestly, Desmoday, I have no idea. You. <laughs> I apologize. Uh, no, it's... I know you're right. 
As for AIs, we adapt I love the Metal Gear Solid series, but if you ask me to analyze any game other than three, I have no idea. <laughs> I could tell you the basic plot outline of most of the series. The only story I like truly care for is three though. For Vengeance, the Metal Gear story is just a really good window dressing for a really fun action game. Send your taste buds a mile high. Well, <laughs> time to be sad in a sombrero. Oh, let's go. All right, Blade Wolf, let's go. I don't want to go. My taste inhibitors. <laughs> oh, this is such a point. This is not a good segment. It's really dumb. No one sees sad sombrero man just waltzing up the front door. <laughs> well, time to be sad and get beat up. <laughs> oh no, I have no offensive defense. What am I supposed to do? I can't parry. Oh no, I'm stunned. I wonder if I can win this fight. I'm not gonna. I'm curious if you can. I guess if he had the fox blade, he could. Oh, here comes Sam. Come on, let's throw down. Get over here. I want a piece of you. <laughs> Not so black and white now, is it? Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> How pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. My name is Monsoon. Of the winds of destruction. Yeah. I guessed as much. This is such a cool shot. Oh, I remember seeing this for the first time. It just blew my mind. Monsoon is so fucking cool. <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, whatever, man. How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. <gasps> 
Right, and no, you can't just say that. Phnom Penh taught me that. Monsoon is so cool. You are the only one to grow up in the Philippines. War is a cruel parent, but an effective teacher. I mean, Monsoon is cool and all, but a kitty is going to show up over here at some point. We need to be ready for it. Free will is a myth. Religion is a joke. Controlled by something greater. Means. The DNA of the soul. I forget exactly when it shows up. They are the culture. They are everything we pass on. Expose someone to anger long enough. Is it the other side? I don't think so. No, I'm pretty confident. Yeah, there it is. Itty. Okay, bye. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lies. <laughs> he waves. Absolved you of guilt when you enjoyed it. Where, where was I? Oh yeah, memes. That is until the illusion was broken. That segment is a lot shorter than I remember it being. The the sit and talk. You have no choices. Probably for the better. This game does not need a lot of exposition, so I do appreciate their indulgence in uh, Metal Gear bullshit. You're right. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death. Arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak, but I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good, really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! <sighs> the bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff. Love the scene. I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper. Some people Jack argue it kind of craps on bodies. Jack's character, but honestly, but I don't you, care. <laughs> all this is a wake up call to what I really believe, what I really am. What do you say? He's a child soldier. He's probably saying, super Jack fucked up in the head. Is back. This is not without not out of the realm of possibility to me. <laughs> Doctor, turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This, this is madness. You do it. <laughs> so goofy. Pain. This is why I fight. <laughs> this is my normal. My nature. You've lost your mind. <laughs> Even the terrorist is like, oh god, this is so messed up. Give him the old Dante combo B. You're the 
boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. I'm gonna turn up the music a little bit. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? This boss fight kicks ass. Actually, why don't I give you a demonstration? I think it's time for Jack to let her rip. I just love the way the thing closes. The perfect capstone. Yep, I lost track of him. <laughs> That's a good way to start it. Oh, I keep doing this. Oh, where'd he go? There we go. Alright, we get to boop him on the snoot. This one's on me! Where's that EMP grenade? There we go. Right, I do need to target that. Careful. No. Yep. Yep. No, I missed. <laughs> Let's try one more time. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Boop on the snoot. No, I uh, I fat fingered the fucking blade cancel button. Yeah, you stupid legs. Oh, 
Whoa, I forgot about this move. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. I know I'm kind of cheesing this guy with the EMP grenades, but eh. Correct me if I'm wrong, but like the little uh, smoke grenade he tosses does damage, right? Because I just distinctly remember uh, getting the no damage achievement for, yeah, the no damage achievement on every boss in this game, except for <laughs> the last boss, for obvious reasons. I'm wondering if I needed to dodge that little smoke grenade. Run on it. Thanks for the platform. Yeah. <laughs> His head just bounces in the background. Iconic Revengeance line. The memes end you, here. Sure as the sun will rise. The slaughter will continue. Now I return to the earth. Wind blows. Rain. I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. <laughs> That's such a weird line out of context. Don't worry, I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later.
All right. <sighs> yeah, B. I skipped a bunch of. Nah, I got a few Bs, but also I skipped a bunch of secret missions. Well, I'm gonna verify if this game has a specific spot. I need to. Say, I'm pretty. Sure, I think that's a save symbol in the bottom there. But to be safe, I'm gonna see if there's like a place I need to save because I think that's gonna be it for this stream. Let's buy some upgrades for my sword. More strength. More absorption. I'll just upgrade this whole thing. There we go. Fully upgraded sword, because it's a sword I like a lot. Now, I think that's going to be it for me. Um, because it's been almost two hours. I don't think I'm going to be able to clear through all of World Marshal in uh, ten minutes. So next time, we will pick up and maybe be able to finish the game. This is a fairly short game. I feel like I should be able to knock it out in one more stream. Ultimately really depends on where the final boss takes me, I guess. Because that could take some time. Actually, wait, let me check the calendar. No, okay, next week is the 27th. So, thank you all for tuning in. I'll catch you next time. I'm going to pause this so we don't get all spoiled on what happens next. See you around.